get their concerns at least heard here in the U.S. by a legitimate and strong enforcement authority. Are there, speaking of authorities, are there changes in the tools or the authorities or scope that you want to share with us? So, with respect to the FTC? Yeah. No, actually, we have plenty of authority. Um, you know, our Section 5 authority allowed us and will continue to allow us to enforce the principles that any company voluntarily signs up to live up to. And um, uh, that's what we did in the past with respect to 39 cases that we brought, um, and we plan to do that in the future. The other authority that we have, which will be very important in terms of cooperation with the DPAs is um, authority under our Safe Web Act, which allows us to assist uh, foreign colleagues, foreign uh, regulators, uh, when they're enforcing a law or a rule that has an analog here in the United States, and if they're going to agree to work with us in, and it's a mutual um, uh, assistance. Then um, we can do things like help them with subpoenas um, and other uh, enforcement tools that we can bring to bear to help them do their investigations. So that authority already exists, and we, we have already been using it, and we will continue to use it. So there's no new change in FTC authority. It's really what Privacy Shield does is it allows for a more streamlined mechanism for communication between us and the